I want to demonstrate how to use Emacs spreadsheets with the example of calculating the costs of two scenarios of a business trip. I want to visit a three day long event. In scenario one, I take a plane and taxi and stay only for the first two days. In scenario two, I go by car and stay for all three days. After comparing the costs, I extend scenario two to also include the parking fees. I start with a table that shows the individual items and corresponding costs. I extend this table adding four more columns. In the heading row I put S1 for items, S1 costs for costs and the same for S2. Now I fill out S1 column. I take one flight, two taxis at home and at the destination. I don't need petrol. I book event 1 and 2 and stay for two nights in the hotel. Now I turn on the preference visualization grid to see the column numbers. In column number 4 I insert the formula and update the whole table. The calculation thus extends to the whole column. Then I fill out the column S2 to model the second scenario. I don't use taxi and plane, but I have to pay petrol for the outgoing and home trip. I visit all three events and stay for three nights at the hotel. In column number 6 I insert the formula to multiply the costs with the scenario 2. And again I update the whole table. Now I got to the bottom row and sum up the costs for both scenarios. This lets me compare the two scenarios. Fine. Now I want to add an additional row to include parking costs. Let's say parking per day costs 33 euros and 20 cents. In the first scenario I don't need it, but in the second I have to pay for three days, which I insert in column S2. Now I only need to recalculate the table and have the new price. This concludes the quick demo for Emacs spreadsheets.